it's Maya. I'm just on my way to Dylan's Candy Bar at Toronto Pearson Airport and we are on the UP Express right now. This is our view and I can't wait to get there. This is my first time on the express train to the airport and it's better than I expected. It's quiet, it's nice, it's comfortable, it doesn't smell bad and it's clean so it's actually awesome. It's air conditioned. It's perfect. This location at the airport is actually the first Dylan's candy bar in Canada so I'm super excited to go and run around and try everything. Hey, I just got to the airport and we're about to go through security. This is probably my favorite part of the store. That is the lollipop tree and it's probably my favorite piece of art in this whole store. As you can see, the walls are decorated too. So I'm just walking around the store right now and kind of checking out everything they have. They have way more than candy. So if you're looking for some cute stuffies or some pillows, they have that here too. I'll show you guys um, some cute stuff. They have a little bunny. They have these candy bars here too, like pillows, donuts, lollipops, cupcakes. I'm trying to see if I can find any super rare candy. So let's see what we have. These are cool, I haven't seen these before. Sour smog balls, crunchy candy with a sour chewy center. This is my favorite candy right here, black licorice, which I get a lot of uh, hate for. It's very controversial. A lot of people don't like it, but I like it. I especially love uh, the salty black licorice. That's my favorite. So I was looking for this all over the store and I finally found it. Oh, this is cool. I think this is super rare. It's freeze-dried, ready-to-eat space food. It's astronaut space food that's freeze-dried, and it's an ice cream sandwich. There's so many colors, I can't decide. Um, I think I'm going to go for something that's obviously not typical. I haven't tried the gold, but I really have my eye on these aqua ones. They're just popping out of me, so I think I'm going to go for these ones. They also have two different kinds of pinks, so obviously I had to get one. I'm going to go for the dark pink. I'm about to try the dark pink ones, and I'll give you guys a little review. They taste really fresh, which is surprising because they come in this, it's not like a sealed package, but they still taste really fresh, almost better than M&M's in a package. Mmm, it's like a marshmallow based. It's good. This is for size. Exactly how you'd expect it to taste.